right? Police say the 66 year old man was pistol whipped in his driveway after returning home from the casino. We know the suspect got away with $1,500 in cash and tonight we spoke with neighbors about the assault. Just a little concerning. It's a pretty quiet neighborhood, so this kind of stuff doesn't happen a lot around here, so a little frightening. I'm glad they found him, and I'm glad to hear that it's not just someone randomly prowling around the neighborhood. A shock for this Aspen Mall neighborhood after hearing a man was robbed at gunpoint by a 28-year-old woman. Police say the victim had to be taken to the hospital early this morning for head trauma after the attack. It happened near the intersection of 2nd Avenue and Western Avenue just before 2 in the morning. According to the criminal complaint, the victim said he was at Rivers Casino for several hours at the sports book and had won multiple bets. After cashing his winnings, the victim said he rode in an elevator with a female to the parking garage. Police said the suspect, 28 year old Jamaica Johnson, got off on the fourth floor and the victim continued to the fifth. Then when driving on Route 28, the 66 year old noticed he was being followed. According to the criminal complaint, when he got home and parked, Johnson went up to the driver's side door with a gun and said, quote, give me the money or I'll shoot you. Police say the victim was knocked to the ground and hit in the head repeatedly before Johnson ran off with the cash. We've been to the casino before, not even something I would even cross my mind, but I guess if I happen to win any money, I'll be a little bit more cautious in the future. Now, spokesperson for the casino released a statement saying Rivers Casino Pittsburgh has over a thousand surveillance cameras monitoring the property 24 7. We cooperated fully with this investigation and commend police on their quick apprehension of the suspect. Now, as for the victim, police say he is expected to be okay. If you have any additional information, you're asked to call the Allegheny County Police Department.